Inspiring yourself can be difficult sometimes, but it doesn't have to be. So in this video, I'm going to share with you some of my favorite resources for UI UX inspiration. Hey designer, Alex here, welcome to the channel and before we jump into today's video, make sure to check out my membership, link is going to be down in the description below. Membership includes all of my courses, digital design products, private access to the Facebook group, practice files for my YouTube tutorials and so much more. So if you're interested in content like that, make sure to check it out once again, link is going to be down in the description below. So the first resource of the day is collectui.com and before we move on any further, links to all of the resources I'm going to mention in this video are going to be down in the description below. Make sure to check them out if you want to easily access them by click. So as I said, collectui.com, fantastic website because right here on the left you can uh, swift through all of these different categories to inspire yourself. So let's say that you are creating a checkout page, you can click the checkout and it's going to give you all of these different checkout examples. Some of them are going to be animated on Dribbble, some of them are not, but basically you can see the position of the buttons, you can see the usage of the colors, usage of imagery, different gradients, different backgrounds, uh, position of these different elements, uh, select state, uh, empty state states all of these things so this website is fantastic uh, especially if you're stuck at a section of a website or an app you don't know how to proceed then you can check out this website just to see the best practices online and what other designers have been doing so once again collectui.com check it out next up we have uijar.com handpicked design inspiration for your real life projects you can join their email list if you want to and you can see popular website tags so let's go with agency for example and it's going to swift and show me these different agencies and you can see them live so if i open up this one for example i can see how it looks like so i can create my collection because i can join or log into this website and i can create a collection let's say for example for typography websites or for fun backgrounds or something like that and finally i can visit live and i can see how this website looks like in real life so i can check out their transitions i can check out how the topography works and how uh, the position of these elements works and something like that so if i go back to the website here you can see some of them uh, how they look like some of them are more simple than others some of them are more complex i can visit this one for example just to check it out just to see how it looks like and it's a bit more simple than all of the, these previous ones but you can see some of the sticky elements right here on the top and how the background videos work how the hover effects work and big imagery so if you're into this then maybe uh, inspiration like this can help you out i'm guessing this is animated so if you're creating these animated background gradients it is then you can check out how it looks like you can check out hover effects how they look like against these animated um, backgrounds for the gradients because they are really trendy at the moment and you can see it right here so you can check out this website once again uijar.com for the latest website inspiration if you're interested and if you're working on a website project next up we have designvault.io ui patterns and design inspiration from real world products so this is great because they took the time to uh, tear apart all these different apps so if we go to let's say discord for example because a lot of you might be familiar with discord you can see the web app you can see the website and you can see all and how it looks like so if we take a look at the web app for example you can see invalid invite you can see invite so they took the time to tear it apart and to check out all of these different states and you can see how this pop-up looks like and the spacing between these elements and the width of the button and for for, for example the padding inside of this inner elements you can see how the pattern looks like and you can see it says invite so when i click right here it's going to take me to all of these different invites, invite patterns on this particular website. So they are popular right here. So actions, let's choose actions, let's say. And I can see all of these different actions. Uh, some of them are animated, some of them are not because some of them are videos. Some of these are just uh, static images. But nevertheless, you can take a look at uh, different invite examples for this particular uh category contextual menu history search so let's say let's see how others are doing search so there are many 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 different options to explore and you can see uh, the tap points and the hidden points and the width of the buttons width of the input fields and so much more so once again designvault.io do check it out because they have plenty to choose from and to inspire yourself next up we have lockup.design and here uh, much like the previous website i can click on let's say hero section 
and it's going to show me all kinds of these different hero section inspirations so I can check them out I can see how they look like from all of these popular real world websites or I can go back and say card for example just to see how some of these cards look like because perhaps I want to position myself um, in this particular industry let's say and I want to see what my competitors are doing so I can explore these different positioning for the cards different spacing different paddings elements let's say that um, with this highlight color so once again you can check this website out if you want to inspire yourself with all of these different categories or you can find your own lock up top design check it out and finally we have siteinspire.com you can search all of these um, popular websites right here you can open them up in new tab and you can see a selected site so I can even visit it right here I can see how it looks like much like the ones which I showed you previously right here so you can check out um, the animations you can check out the opening stages of the website you can check out um, sliders transitions and all of these different things if you're interested and of course you can scroll down and see this website is more focused on modern looking websites so you will not find typical agency websites right here this is gumroad and you might be familiar with it um, this website has some great uh, animations because i visited it uh, recently so if we take a look right here and start scrolling you can see how this looks like it's fantastic so if you're interested in this sort of thing you can check it out but once again siteinspire.com if you're looking for modern and minimal inspiration for websites so there we go those are the resources for this video i really hope you liked them if you did make sure to press the like button make sure to subscribe to the channel because i upload new videos every single week all about adobe xd design passive income techniques uh, resources just like these ones so if you're interested in more content like that make sure to subscribe and make sure to check back next time until next video take care